We here at Digistore think that the um, DVS Spice Box is the perfect SAN solution for Autodesk systems, especially the Smoke on Mac applications, for reasons that I want to explain in the next couple of minutes. Let's take a look why the Spicer Box is such an interesting SAN system. As I said, it is a SAN in the box. And in order to understand that, let's take a look at how a SAN usually is set up. Basically, you have a bunch of hard drives which are connected to um, a master computer. This computer, the so-called metadata controller, is um, managing the reads and writes to the file system, which is in this case a Stornext file system. You need a fiber channel switch. And very often, you don't want to connect the whole facility um, using fiber channel connections. So you usually have a so-called gateway or NAS computer, which provides basically Ethernet access. So here on the lower left, we have a so-called NAS computer, which basically does nothing else than sharing the data over network, over TCP IP protocols, for example, to other clients. Now, if we take a look what the Spicer box does, it basically merges all these components to one single component. And as long as you don't work with uh, too many clients, they can even be simply directly attached to the storage. Another problem in a post-production environment, which is um, specialized on DPX file sequences, such as color grading systems or Autodesk finishing systems, is the fragmentation level of the Stornext SAN. In fact, this is a problem with every SAN, and um, it's just a question on how you approach this. So if we take a look at the Spicer box over here, and we have uh, two systems writing DPX file sequence to the box at the same time, of course, at some point, we will run into fragmentation. And um, a not so healthy SAN will look a little bit like this. Um, red represents fragmented uh, single files, while orange represents um, scattered file sequences. Okay, so obviously red is a much worse level of fragmentation than the orange one. <clears throat> and um, that will uh, consequently lead to a high decrease in performance. DVS provides a tool called Mephisto, which basically fixes and optimizes the fragmentation level and completely defragments the storage. In order to show you that, I'm going to log into the Spicer box. So what I have here is um, the Mephisto defragmentation software, which runs on Linux. So it is currently scanning my SAN, which is called Spicer Volume Zero. And if I expand all this, I can see that um, most of my files um, have a blue dot, which basically means they, they are pretty healthy. Um, so the more I expand, I have 4K footage, 2K footage. This is all healthy, and um, this is how it, would, how it actually should look like. Um, if I go into the bitmap view, you can see that the system is currently scanning and populating the white table here. And um, only bits and pieces are currently defragmented. <clears throat> okay, so defragmented means blue, and red means um, every single file is all over the disks, basically. So the possibilities to defrag the storage are massive. I have the possibility to select the whole volume and add it to my defragmentation list. There are instances when I may want to defrag um, single files or single folders, but in most cases, I want to go for a complete volume. Um, then I have the possibility to optimize it manually. Um, I have the possibility to do a daily or weekly event. For example, at um, <clears throat> 24 hours, I know that um, the facility is more or less um, not in use, the equipment is, is, is idle, and I can start to um, to defrag at full speed. But then after a bunch of hours, maybe nine hours, I know that the first people come in and the defragmenter needs to stop working and um, provide the bandwidth for my daily jobs. Um, the, best, the best mode is the so-called background mode, which allows me to reserve a bandwidth 
for example, if I know that I basically never use um, a certain headroom in my of my um, sand bandwidth, I could reserve 100, 200 or more megabytes per second just for shuffling data around. Okay, so the Mephisto software um, is a defragmentation software which is unique for the Storenext file system. Um, there is nothing like it and although Windows users are very much used to a defragmentation software of this kind, there is none in the Storenext environment. Thank you for listening and I will be back soon with another video.